The exchange life is the gospel. I'm going to teach you by illustration of this up here. First of all, this is going to represent all humanity, Adam. And in Adam is all humanity. All of us in Adam. Very important that we understand that. 1 Corinthians 15, 22. Let's read that together. For as in Adam all died. So when Adam sinned and died, everyone was in him. And everyone what? Died. So everyone in Adam died. All humanity. You didn't do anything to inherit that. He did it. So we got it. Guilty. That doesn't sound fair, does it? But he represents all humanity. Now let's look at Romans 5, the next scripture. And he says, Therefore, just as through one man sin entered into the world, so Adam brought sin into the world. And death through sin. And thus death spread to all all men because all sin. So death came to every human being ever born. All right? But the free gift is not like the offense. For if by the one man's offense many died, much more the grace of God and the gift by grace of the one man, Jesus Christ, abounded to many. So Jesus came on the scene to take us out of Adam and put us in Christ. The Bible calls him the second Adam. So, at salvation, God says, I'm taking Roger out of this Adam. And I'm putting him in the second Adam, Jesus Christ. So, now I want to show you what happened through the baptism of the Holy Spirit so you were taken out of Adam, and the Bible says that you were crucified with Christ. What happens to a crucified man? Okay, well, I made a little cemetery here. Sorry, I need to turn it around. It's not a science project. I had fun doing this. It brought back childhood memories. Rest in peace, Roger. So I was crucified with Christ, so I died. Romans 6, we just read it a minute ago. Let's put Romans 6 back up so we can read it again. Uh, yeah, Romans 6. Don't you know that all of us were baptized into Christ? We were baptized into his death. So when Jesus was crucified, I was crucified and I died. But then he says that we were baptized into his death and placed into the tomb. Now Jesus wasn't buried like this. He was in a tomb. But I'm going to make a little grave here. And we're going to bury the old man. You and me. We're burying him. He's gone. Gone. Rest in peace, old man. He doesn't come back. He's dead. But then, according to the scripture, he says, I'm going to give you a new heart, the exchange. I'm going to give you a new spirit. I'm going to remove that old nasty stuff. I'm going to remove it. And I'm going to give you an obedient heart. I'm going to give you my spirit, Christ in us. And so he's going to pour himself in us. Now, as he is, so are we in this world. Clean, redeemed restored in his image the power of God